morning, everyone. They tell a story about they once asked this very successful man, what's the secret to your success? And he said two words. They said, really, which two words? He said, the secret to my success is good decisions. He said, really, what's the secret to making good decisions? He said one word. What? Experience. He said, really? And how do you get experience? He said two words, bad decisions. <laughs> we learn from our past experiences. As the Pirkei Avot says, Ein chacham kabal the greatest uh, lessons of life, the greatest wisdom comes from experience. However, as someone once said, only a fool learns from his own mistakes. A wise person learns from someone else's mistakes. You don't have to make the mistake yourself, you can learn from the past. And that's why in this week's parsha, the Torah says the following, Zachor Yemot Alam, remember the days of bygone, the past. Why? Binu Shnoz Badovadar, learn the lessons from generation to generation. Sha'al Avicha, ask your father, Viyagetcha, he'll tell you. Zikhenecha, your grandparents, your elders, and they will relate to you. And others, the Torah says, learn from your parents, learn from your grandparents. They've gone through a lot of the challenges and struggles and doubts that you went through. Why do you have to learn from your own mistakes? Let them tell you about their failures and learn from them. And go back to your parents and ask them and ask your grandparents. I heard a beautiful interpretation that says like this. Remember that they understand the lessons from generation to generation. Ask your father and he will tell you. You know what he'll tell you? Zikhenecha. Let's go ask grandpa and grandma and they will relate to us. In other words, when your kid comes, they had children and all the way down to us. So the little kid says, but mom, I asked dad and he said, we evolved from apes and chimpanzees and monkeys. And the mom says, yeah, dad was telling me about his side of the family. I'm telling you about my side of the family, right? But there's two perspectives to life. One perspective is we come from apes and monkeys and chimpanzees. Well, if that's the case, why would I want to ask my father or my mother what they think or my grandparents? They're closer to the apes and the chimpanzees. I'm more developed and more sophisticated as a human. They're more animal-like. I don't want to talk to them. I want to talk to the future generations, to the youth. They have the wisdom because they're more technologically advanced or scientifically advanced. And therefore, there's this generation gap between children and parents and grandparents. But if you believe like we believe, God made Adam and Eve, the first handmade humans by God. And then they had children. Then there was Abraham and Sarah and Isaac and Rebecca and Moses and all the generations. Then I want to look back to the wisdom of the past. And that's the Jewish perspective. Ask your parents and your grandparents. And ask your parents and they should say, let's go ask the grandparents because they have more wisdom that comes from more experience.